Hi, welcome to Crazy Cordic. Or today uh, we're going to. Well, this is our site. Okay, so this is our site. Looks really cool. Somebody uploaded our thing. I'm so proud. Yeah. Anyway, so this is our site, and we'll link it in the description. And today, what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn this site into an app. so that people can download it on their phone so they don't have to visit the site over and over again every time we update something on the site it will just show up on their phone itself right yeah cool so the way we do this is we're going to use something called thunkable yes let's build powerful native apps Sounds fun. The logo and the name together <laughs> make it so look and sound very not suitable for work. <laughs> yeah, once we make an app, can we like upload it to the Google App Store or Apple Store or whatever? Google App Store, yes. Uh, iOS app, I don't know if I can make it because like Google App Store has a one-time fee which I can pay. iOS has a monthly or a yearly fee, something like that, which I do not want to pay. So anybody who's using Android can download our app. People using iOS will just have to wait. Okay. Yeah. Today we're gonna turn our own thing. <laughs> hey, let's let's first go into settings and change the basic stuff that we know we can change. Sure, whatever this is, upload icon. Code go. Where is our logo? Yeah, here. Open. Okay. What's our app gonna be called? Crazy Code Go. Yeah. Okay. Thought so. Um, version name description. My put here. Wait, Firebase. Blah blah. Okay, we'll get to this part later. Description. My what do we put? Learn Python and Java. Now we will get to the teaching you Java. <laughs> <laughs> no, just keep up. Keep up with. Crazy code go and their projects. Cool. I think that's a fair enough name. It's basically our entire website, but on a phone uh, app. So okay, what's the plan? The plan is we have the whole website on here, right? Yeah. And do we yes. want anything else? No. Cool. Uh, okay. Can you uh, live test on device? Someone needs to live test on device and see how it's looking so far. Okay, this is what our website looks like. I mean, this is what our app looks like. Oh, okay. So far, so it's basically our entire website. Okay. With everything that we need. Yeah. Cool. Yes, build powerful native mobile yeah. apps. <laughs> <laughs> I 
the whole site you know the the, the caption and the picture and the name is so disturbing oh my gosh are you let me go into the project Oh, yeah. Also, apparently, you cannot download and publish apps with push notifications because they are a pro component. What do you mean? What? 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 <laughs> push notifications are a pro component, while all thunkers can add push notifications to their app project and live test them in their app Android only. Only pro thunkers can download and publish apps with push notifications. Damn it, thunkers! Why do they call us thunkers? <laughs> oh my god! Oh, sorry. This is sound like a very bad fan fiction happening. <laughs> So wait. So if there's like no point in doing push notifications then, because I'm not gonna buy pro thugger or whatever. So <laughs> the buy pro thugger, you're gonna become pro thugger. That is worse. That is worse. <laughs> I added one more screen, right? And um, we're gonna name this screen. We should take, I don't know, take the web viewer and put it into screen one. Somehow, go into this, <laughs> please. Totally, edit. I don't know, man. Do something. Go, go in there. That's what she said. <laughs> yes, they they can hear you. <laughs> go. <laughs> I don't care what's happening. Okay. Yes. Yes. I. I. Oh my God! It made screen one a sub screen. <laughs> Ah, I'm okay. gonna die. <laughs> come back, come back to this screen, okay? We'll first no. let's work with crazy before they go home. Um, we're we're gonna put a put a put a put a put a put a I don't know data input. Yeah, totally. Let's put that in there. Yeah, man, mm. looks looks very uh I don't know <laughs> <laughs> happening. <laughs> Why is the background black? <laughs> and why is why is the entire thing black? <laughs> Please help! <laughs> I don't know how this works. Okay. Entering month, date, year. Uncomfortable <laughs> date. Okay, there you can change color of data input. Alright, alright, here. Yeah. We wanted what color? Purple, I guess. White. What is that? Yeah. <laughs> that is our data input. <laughs> I think that color is more according to our theme. Yeah, but white is would be more visible while we are working on it. Okay, so we'll later change. go and. Yeah. Okay, makes yeah. sense. What What is this? <laughs> yeah. Why is this like? Why do we need the date of birth? I, mean, I don't. I don't know why. I don't. We don't. That was the default. Yeah, but it, it you kind of can see that data input looks like a calendar, so you knew it would ask you for some date, which we kind of don't need. It's, <laughs> it's not like data input. It's not. <laughs> it's not data input. It's <laughs> date. For our home page, first add our logo and that thingy. I I, I don't know. Wait, let our me logo go, yeah. situation. Let me go get stuff. 
for actually taking data input and not date input. My fault. <laughs> Die. Text input. What the text input? Oh yeah. Okay, makes sense. All right. First, let's get our logo. Right. Uh, we want to add an image. Yeah, images. Images. Yeah, yeah. I got yeah. it. I got it. Just. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> Shush. What do you mean file source? I, it's from my... Oh uh, my god, what happened? <laughs> what just happened? They, uh, they're gonna take it to me. <laughs> what? What, what just happened? <laughs> they, uh, they just took me back to the same place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Kankabal has lost, lost its mind. And it removed the image for some reason. They were like, no, no image for you. <laughs> <coughs> okay, please let me yeah, no. let me somehow upload an image. Some I don't know. <laughs> is, is that a possibility? Do you guys do that? Yes, upload. <laughs> do that. Obviously they do that. <laughs> Can't be too sure. Use the logo first. Okay. And Why is this also black? A few minutes later. Logo have a white border on two sides. <laughs> I have no idea. Is that is was this a part of the actual image that we uploaded or is this a thunkable? Uh, um, <clears throat> I guess it's a thunkable thing. What just happened? Border. Just, just make the border Which black, it will be gone. Done. There's still a red dotted line situation now. <laughs> Why? What is that for? Wait, let me check on the actual. Yeah, on the actual thing, it it looks fine. Okay, you don't have to worry. Like, it doesn't look like it has. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> cool. So that's our logo. Do I need to make it a little bigger? Mm -hmm. I guess. You could look at the live on mine and, you know, keep track that way. Yeah, this is all right, right? Yeah, this looks good. Okay, so that done. <coughs> yeah. Now we want to take an input about the text and all, right? Text input? Yeah. <coughs> yeah, very ugly it is. <laughs> you can change how it looks. Yeah, I know, but still, it's very ugly. <laughs> okay, cool. Looks good. <clears throat> it does not. <laughs> no, no, it doesn't. Yeah, fair enough. Whatever, same thing. Um, but it looks very bad, and I can't change the background gray color, and that's driving me crazy. <laughs> okay, first put a label. First, put a label that says enter your email or something like that. Report. 
yeah and then below that put maybe another one text input yeah text input yeah is that ask for uh, i don't know but it should ask for something why <laughs> because otherwise the screen feels incomplete password but then we are doing the whole login thing yeah i guess One eternity later. Is this, is this better? <laughs> Now the login is floating on top. <laughs> is this better? <laughs> it's still in a different class. No, no, no. It's fine. No, it's fine. Wait, wait. It's not fine, but yeah, it's better. It's kind of floating. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can try to bring it a little down. Is it? Yeah, a little more down. Are you looking at my screen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's fine. Now it's fine. Can you can you see the situation on my screen? <laughs> I can. But it looks perfect now. See, I showed, uh, sent you. Yeah, this is almost killing me. But you're <laughs> kidding. Name this screen as your uh, sign-up screen. Yeah. Just sign up and naming it. Don't yeah. need to put screen. Sign sign up. Okay, cool. And now make another screen which is called login. Do you yeah, add create new screen. <coughs> cool. Um, doesn't need this need to be like screen two. Like, <laughs> you know, this should come before that screen, right? Yeah, it should. Yeah, no, it doesn't do that. Can you like pull the web viewer into screen two? No, I can't. <laughs> it worked. It worked. It worked. Okay. Thank God. And <laughs> yeah, now you can just edit screen one. Um. Screen one can be long. Yeah. So before you do that, we can just go into the buy, uh, like the building block thing. Uh, blocks next to the design. There's a blocks. Ah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And and go to the sign up. Okay, and use button two, I think. Yeah. When button? Literally. Use. <laughs> we don't have to go this far. Go to the button two. Click. Pull that into the white area. Take that whole block. Yeah. Put anywhere you want. Uh, yeah, I know. And then do me. I think logic me. It will work. Control me, na. Yeah. Okay. Check control. Yeah. Navigate to. Navigate to. Yeah. Yeah. And then change That's the. Fine, no? Yeah. Change change that to login. Done. Oh, this was fun. <laughs> Get like the two text boxes and Nietzsche make another uh, situation which says already not a use new user sign up. Okay, like do the same thing. So and then it goes back to the sign up page. Yes, because what <laughs> is a human if not dumb? <laughs> exactly. What is a human if not dumb? Exactly.
binding the button. Yeah, fun. Okay, this is it for today, right? Yeah, and the website is already done. Like, if you open the that thing, the website will come. So now all we need to do is create the database, and we'll be. Oh, we need to bind. No, not bind. Yeah, once we create no, the we database, bind. then only so we can bind and do that or that, right? No, no, but no, no. We have to do a whole thingy where this button, this sign up button, and this. Login button takes you to the web page because yes, so take sign. So that's what I'll do now. Once you do sign up, we'll bind it so that first it enters everything into the database, then it takes you to the third screen. And so same can thing. I, can we do the takes it to the third screen without entering into the? Oh, no, we can't. What am I saying? Yeah, we pull, <laughs> cut this out of the video. <laughs> yeah. So that's it for this video. Next time we'll create a database, create a whole authentication, and then hopefully that week the app will be available for download. Right? Fingers crossed. Cool. I hoping that we don't mess this up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cool. Uh, see you guys next time. Bye.